welcome back guys to my channel guys uh, in this video we are going uh, or you can say this is my second video of sc900 security compliance and identity fundamental course in this video we are going to understand about the microsoft pri uh, privacy principle So, privacy is about making meaningful choice, meaningful choice about how and why data is collected and used. So, in simple, if I say it is privacy is meaningful choice about how and why data is collected and used so Many times you may see when you uh, create your email or something, you enter your private information. So the organization or the company who collect your data, your personal information. why they collect those and how what they are going to do with those informations this is the principle of the privacy or you can say privacy principles there are six privacy principles six First, control. Now, as a customer, as a customer, put you in control of your privacy with easy to use tools and you have a clear choice transparency is another another pillar everything need to be transparent about your data collections and how the informations are being uh, going to be used everyone need to be make informed and let them take their decisions then we have security security so that it can ensure your data is being protected they use different security mechanism encryptions strong security mechanism is actually applied to protect your data 
then strong legal protection strong legal protection so we need to follow the rules and regulations legal actions need to be enforced and if required legal actions can be taken which is actually fundamental of human rights then the fifth pillar is no content based targeting no content based targeting like you not to use email chat files or any other personal content to target target any advertising the sixth one is benefits to you so when microsoft collects data it is actually used to benefit you the customers to make your experience better now if you want you can go to privacy at my privacy.microsoft.com and you can explore the different options you have you can go here you can see visit privacy dashboard microsoft trust center so if you go here you can see your con you control your data your data belongs to you so you can see the informations you can read if you want lot of informations are publicly av available which may help you to understand the privacy so you can check this sites you can visit these sites for more informations so we have 
different options there that you can check you have compliance manager you have a uh, trust document you have a uh, trust center you have resources my library and also industries and and reasons so if you want you can also go to service trust portal and over here you can check the your compliance documents it's loading little bit time meanwhile we can go to docs.microsoft.com also visit to these sites see this compliance offering so there are different documentations which you can actually go through and you can see you can explore asia specific india maitri and see ministry of electronics and information technology and you can see the terms and conditions or the legal problem so every country has their own and microsoft is following the their regulations rules and regulations so if you want to go and check other compliance resources just scroll down and you can check you can check you have to explore the different documentations which are listed here in this site so based on the country you belongs to you will take your 
countries' rules and regulations. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope this video will definitely help you to enhance your uh, knowledge level. And uh, guys, if you have not uh, subscribed my channel, requesting you to subscribe my channel and share my uh, share my videos with your friends and colleagues. Thank you guys. Hope to see you very soon in my next video. Stay updated. Bye.